Hello class, this is Mrs. Barrow, and this is your podcast on how to sign up for Edpuzzle and how to use Edpuzzle. So the first thing is you go to edpuzzle.com, you go to I'm a new student. Now, you type in your first name, last name, Okay, and your username will be the first letter of your first name, your full last name, and your six-digit birthday. In case you don't know what your six-digit birthday is, it's the two-digit month. I was born in March, so mine is the third month. The two-digit date, I was born March 11th, so I put 11. And then the two digit year, which is the last two digits of the year where you were born. So I'm putting 83 because I'm old enough to see the original Nintendo come out. Now for your password, you're going to put your crazy password. If you don't know what that is, you can come see me. And then I'm going to click sign up. Once you get to this screen, you go to join class. Your class code for this year is E-D-K-O-B-O-I, and you search. And there it is, sixth grade U.S. history with Miss Barrow, and I'm going to join. Now, all the videos that are assigned to you will be here. You should not start a video until you come to it in the activity list. Otherwise, it may be too hard and you won't know what you're doing. There are quizzes within the video so that I know how you're doing. Ed puzzles will be points if it says so on your activity list. Once you start an Ed puzzle, you are unable to skip ahead, but you may come to a question. Up eight push peeps. We have a push review this Spanish, English, French, and Dutch colonization video for you today. This one exactly. is screaming to me a potential essay topic or short answer question topic. So make sure you are familiar with these European powers and their colonization of the Americas. All right. So if you see up here, this is the standard that the video is linked to. The standards are what we use to determine if you learned what you were supposed to use this year. If you don't know what the standards are, you can go to cpoms.com and go to 8th grade because U.S. history is actually normally an 8th grade course. So if you want to continue, if it's just a note, you press continue. All right, so let's start off. This is a combination of periods 1 and 2. Now, much of these periods focus on European exploration and their impact on the Americas. And as I just mentioned, this is a great potential short answer slash essay topic. AP has asked these questions and before And then when you get the to the questions, you can answer can them or re-watch. Well Thank you for watching.